Hey y'all, it's Island Coupon Gal. I've missed you guys so much. In a nutshell, I had the flu. I was bedridden since Thursday, so I have not been shopping. Last night was my first time being out of the house. <laughs> I went to the doctor yesterday. I feel a thousand percent better. Thank you guys so much for your awesome personal messages and comments, for reaching out to me when you guys haven't seen me the past couple of days. It makes me feel so loved when you guys show your concern and show your support. Also, so many positive comments. Um, a couple of my videos had a little bit of negativity in the comment section, and a lot of you came to my defense, and I just want to thank you and tell you sincerely, I love you guys. Thank you so much. You guys are the reason I do these videos. For all of, all of you out there who enjoy watching my videos and who get me, thank you so much. I love you, and... Um, I just can't say enough about it. So thank you guys. Um, I also want to give a shout out to 77520 Anna. Girl, I got your envelopes. Thank you so much. Anna sends me coupons every month and she is so sweet. Without her, a lot of these coupons, I'm sorry, a lot of these deals I wouldn't have been able to do because she sent me printable coupons I did not have. Also T. Elliot 27, I got her package today. She sent me tear pad coupons for Ed Hardy, $5 off, one ounce or larger, and they don't expire until June. I love Ed Hardy. She knew that. She sent me a package with 10 coupons. Thank you so much. I also want to give a big cyber hug to Stephanie87. I got to her comment late. She left me, a, left me a comment on one of my videos from a while ago telling me about how she was robbed. They took all of her coupons, all of her couponing stuff, if you will, her binder, her everything she had for couponing they stole isn't that disgusting but I feel so bad Stephanie I am reaching out to you girl and giving you a huge squeeze hug of support I'm so sorry that happened to you but keep your head up girl also want to give a shout out to Igor thank you so much for everything okay so um I also want to let you guys know that they denied my stockpile room being built um the architectural review board said that it was visible from the street so no go on that, so we're going to have to make second pl or <laughs> secondary plans for my stockpile video. So anyways, let's get into the deals. I want to thank Rob for putting out his video about the Nature Made Minis overage. These are buy one, get one free at $15.29. Um, the Full Strength Mini Super Omega 3 is the only one, from what I understand, that works. So I picked up two of them, $15.29, and we have $10 CVS coupons that are PDFs available on their website. I believe Rob linked them at his um at his blog post on the clam. So that's $20 worth of CVS coupons, and then we have $3 manufacturer coupons on coupons.com. So $26 worth of coupons for items that cost you $15.29. That's $10.71 in overage. However, both coupons beep. I'm not sure why. It's not because of the value, and it's not because it's a fake coupon. I guess a couple of people have had problems with the cashier saying that it was a fraudulent coupon. It is definitely not a fraudulent coupon. I'm not sure why it beeped. It also added the value. Instead of deducting the coupon value, it added $10. So I'm not quite sure why. She ended up taking $20 off in CVS coupons later on in my transaction. So this is definitely a your mileage may vary situation. So that helps me out with my cash card deal and other items. Picked up two of the Scott at $7.49 each. That was $14.98. <clears throat> Excuse me. I had two of the $1.25 printables. Thank you, Anna. As well as $4 worth of CVS coupons, $2 for each one. The second one does beep. You can only use one per transaction um, without them beeping, but my cashiers are awesome, so they push the second one through. So that was $6.50 in coupons for the Scott. Picked up two of the Glade Sense and Sprays. No, not Sense and Sprays, I'm sorry. The Expression Starter Kit. These are on sale for $3. That was $6 total for the sprays, and I had two of the $2 printables from coupons.com. I had six of the candles at $3 each, that was $18, and I had three of the two off two coupons. Thank you, Soldier Girl, for the idea. I did see your video, I just um, didn't comment. I don't know why. I think I was in the car when I was listening to it, but great idea with the two off two coupons. So that was $38.98 in cash card deals. I know I only needed $30, but I figured the other $8 and change would carry over to my next cash card. That way I could use two four off 20s, and with my $16.50 worth of other coupons, that was $24.50 in coupons. So I paid $14.48 and got back a $10 cash card, as well as I have 
$8.98 tracking for my next one. Fantastic. The AccuCheck Nano is on, I don't know if it's a monthly, I'm thinking it's a monthly deal because I didn't see it in the ad. It's a limit of four per card. These are on sale for $14.99 each, and you get back a $5 ECB for each one with a limit of four. I did two in this transaction, so I got back ten. And if your store, if your store accepts expired CVS coupons, I will link this below, the PDF printable of this document. It's a magazine. You want to scroll to page six and print just page six, and it'll print this out, cut this part out. You'll pay $4.99 and get back five. But if you pick up two of them in the same transaction, that'll total you $29.98. Therefore, you could use a four off 20. $20 worth of CVS coupons to pay $5.98 and get back $10. These coupons do state limit one per customer, which essentially should mean one per transaction. Again, you might want to do that at one of your favorite stores, and they don't scan. They have to be manually entered in any way because they are expired. So they shouldn't have a problem, but if they do, just split them up. The Renew is $7.99. I had the $2.50 printable from coupons.com, paid $5.49 and got back $5. The Tharmacare, thank you again, Anna. These aren't on sale. They're regular price, $7.49. I picked up two of them to total me $14.98. I had two of the $3 manufacturer coupons from Anna. I also had an expired $2 Redbox coupon off any Tharmacare, two count or larger. So that was $8 in coupons. I paid $6.98 and got back four. Not the greatest. And my area did not get the Pfizer rebate form. But we do like the Thermacare. So, and essentially, I had other items to bulk up my total to use the 4 off 20 and whatnot. So, not too, too bad for the Thermacare. The Skin Skintimate, I picked up these items. There are cheaper ones that work for this deal. The Edge, they both have the BOGO coupons. But I was trying to use my $2.50 off of a $12 shaving purchase Redbox coupon. So, these are $3.99 each at my store. That totaled me $7.98. I used the BOGO manufacturer coupon. It was a printable from coupons.com, no longer available, as well as a 55 cents off one manufacturer coupon. I'm not sure which insert it came from. Check a coupon database. I like Southern Savers. It'll tell you which insert. I believe it expires at the end of February, like the 28th. So that was $3.55 in coupons. I paid $4.43 and got back two. Now, I've seen a couple of videos talking about um, using the two off two with this purchase. At CVS, you are allowed to coupon on a free item, but it's a free item made free by a sale, not a, an item made free by coupon. So when you use a BOGO coupon at CVS, you can only use a manufacturer coupon on the item you are still paying for. When, you, when we talk about using a coupon on a free item at CVS, it's, we're talking about a BOGO sale. So if these were on sale, buy one, get one free, I could use... Well, I could use the buy one, get one free manufacturer coupon, make them both free. But if I only had 55 cent manufacturer coupons, I could use one for each one, okay? So yes, that was the deal for the skin submit. And then with that, I paired the Gillette. These Gillette for Women Sensor Excel five count cartridges, these are on clearance for $3.24. My intent was to pick this up as well as a ProGlide manual razor to use that $10 off the ProGlide razor when you buy the cartridges, manufacturer coupon from the P&G, and then I totally forgot. But these two together, the skin submit and the sensor, that totaled me $11.22 and the 250 off 10 did go through. So I'm sorry, 250 off of 12. It did go through with no beeps, I believe, because I was high enough to the almost to that $12 threshold. So, anyways, didn't use any coupons for this other than the Redbox coupon. But if you are going to do this deal, if you can find those on clearance, this would be your best bet. Picking up one of the five pack cartridges at $3.24 and the Gillette Pro Glide Razor at $10.99 will total you $14.23. Use your $10 off the Pro Glide Razor when you buy any cartridge from the PG. You'll pay $4.23 and get back five, which makes it a 77 cent moneymaker. If you got that red box coupon, that will decrease your out of pocket by $2.50, which increases your moneymaker by $2.50. So use whatever red box coupons you've got. From what I understand, there are different um variations, different values for that coupon. The Dr. Scholl's is not the best deal. These are spend 20, get back six. This one was 7.29, this one was 7.49, and this one was eight, 8.49. So that was 23.27 in Dr. Scholl's. I could use a four off 20, and then three of the $3 off one, any Dr. Scholl's for her manufacturer coupons from the 113 Smart Source, paid 10.27 and got back six. Again, not the greatest deal for Dr. Scholl's. I'm sure there are cheaper ones, but guys, this was my first haul back from being sick. I didn't feel all my game. The Sally is spend 10, get back four. 
These gel strips are $14.99. I had the $5 manufacturer coupon. I'm not sure where it came from. I got them from eBay, but they were in an insert. And then I had $2 off any Sally, was it Sally Hansen or $2 off any $10 cosmetic Redbox coupon. All current. This one was current as well as the shaving items were current because I know that sometimes you guys get confused when I use the expired, but I really didn't use too many expired Redbox coupons in this transaction. So that was $7 in coupons. I paid $7.99 and got back four. Love these items. $3.99 out of pocket for this. I'll pay that any day. The BIC, I used it to bulk my total. These are just $3.99, regular price. So that totaled me $15.99. I'm sorry, $15.96. And I used two of the BOGO coupons, took off the max value. No, actually, the second one had to be adjusted down to just make these free, but that was almost $16 worth of product to use a 4 off 20. I also picked up four candy bars, two Snickers, two Twix. They're buy one, get the second one for $0.25, cents, and when you buy two or more at $1.19, they become a dollar. So $2 for those two, and my son ate the other one, and $0.25 cents a piece for each Twix, so two fifty. And I used this buy two, get one free manufacturer coupon. This time, they took off... Oh, they didn't take off the max L. She took off $1.19 for some reason. I'm not sure. But I also had the dollar off two tear pad that Boss Lady $15.98 sent me. So thank you, girl. That was just to bump me up to my next increment of 20. Okay, so for this transaction, total ECBs used was 21. I paid 15 cents plus 3 cents tax out of my pocket. And I got back 41, 10 of which was a cash card. Okay, beauty club spending was like $22.97, so I don't think I'll be getting back a beauty buck, but that's not a big deal. This transaction here, I burned a lot of ECBs. Let me show y'all. I got a lot of stationary items, just stuff that I needed that was really expensive. So this really wasn't a transaction that was like a good one to share with you as far as like money-making scenarios. I just repeated a couple of things. I did another AccuCheck. I did the Edge. Um, I believe these are $349. Let's take a look at my receipt, shall we? Where are you? Yeah, sorry. <laughs> those are three forty nine for the shave or the edge shave gels. So those are a little bit cheaper with the Bogo coupon. I'm not sure if there is a cents off manufacturer coupon for that. Um, I did the Sally again, did the Renew, picked up some clearance items. Thank you, Igor. He texted me about the Lysol No Touch. These are two dollars and seven cents. I had the two dollar manufacturer coupon. These blade products, it's the, sh the mesh shower tool. They're on clearance for $1.12 each, so I picked up two of them. That was $2.24. I had an expired $2 off any two blade CVS coupon that came out in the Reinventing Beauty magazine that had Charlize Theron on the cover. As you know, my CVS accepts them expired. So if yours accepts them expired, makes these 12 cents a piece out of pocket. Really, really cheap compared to the Axe. I don't know if they work. I don't use these, obviously, because I'm not a man, but... Not a bad little gift idea. And then these Right Guard Total Defense 5. Funny story with these, I'll tell you in a second. These are on clearance for $1.37, and there were doll dollar peelies on each one. Made them $0.37 cents out of pocket. I didn't realize it, but I had a Redbox coupon for, I think it's $2 off any $8 bar soap or body wash purchase. Probably would have threw that in if I had thought about it, but... I obviously didn't have enough between these four. I probably would have tried to pick up some other things. But anyways, if you printed this coupon off, I printed this off a while ago, and it did expire on the 27th of January. However, if you printed yours a few days later than me, yours might still be valid. I'm not sure how long ago these were available, but it's $2 off any four Right Guard bar products. Check your binder and see if you have these, and if they are still current, you might want to score on those. So, um, let's see, is that it? Yeah, that's it for this transaction. I just wanted to kind of show you uh, the clearance items. So, yeah, $20 moneymaker for those items. I spent $21 and I got back $41. Not bad at all, especially after a very brief hiatus. I also wanted to show you guys something I found at Rite Aid. I did this on Thursday. So, there was a Dove deal that these clearance items tracked for. And I'm sorry that I wasn't able to get up a video sooner. But the reason I'm telling you about these... The Dove Damage Therapy Volume Boost Shampoo, as well as the Dove Damage Therapy Energize Shampoo, 12 fluid ounce, they're on clearance for $1.24 at my store, okay? So I picked up two of them, that totaled me $2.48, and then I was able to use um, the $1.50 off two, it says buy the shampoo, get $1.50 off. It was a printable that was available a while ago. It is no longer available from coupons.com, but it doesn't expire until March sometime. Essentially, it's buy one, get $1.50 off the second one. So basically, I'm thinking it's $1.50 off two, right? 
So you pay 98 cents out of pocket. It did track that 248 for the Dove promotion that was last week. I believe it was just a weekly deal. But there's a 75 cent I bought a credit for Dove shampoo or conditioner. So not a bad, not a bad deal, especially if Dove is your brand. Okay, guys, thanks so much for watching. Again, thank you to everyone who showed me love and support. I love you guys so, so much. And I will see you in the next video.